Gonna build a mountain from a little hill. Hey guys, and thank you so much for tuning into my channel. My name is The Lady Designer, and we're back with another Let's Play Franchise Mode episode. And oh my god, these camels, they make so much noise. But quickly, before we jump into it, let us thank our very first fantastic sponsor of the channel, Instant Gaming. At Instant Gaming, you can get your most favorite games with up to 70, sometimes even 90% discount. If you use the link in the description down below, you will get an amazing discount, and you will also be supporting the channel. So whether you're looking for a discount on Planet Zoo, The Sims, City Skylines, Jurassic World Evolution, or any other game, go and check out the link down in the description. I made a change. I did change the settings right over here. Someone also mentioned, thank you so much for all your comments, guys, and all your amazing support. I really, really love to read your comments, so please keep them coming. Uh, but uh, someone mentioned, like, you know what, at this stage, when your zoo is getting this big, you really just need to reduce the speed uh, with the animal age to five because you really are not able to keep up anymore. Even with five, it, it at some point becomes to, uh, to, to, to be very hard. And I remember that with the other franchise series we did, that at some point it was indeed uh, becoming pretty tough to uh, keep up with everything. Uh, but we're gonna do our best. Oh no, pronghorn antelope. Wait, why, why are we zooming out here? Oh no. Gab Gabila, oh my god, I'm so sorry. Rest in peace, lovely. I'm so sorry. Oh, this is so sad. Ugh, what a great start. No, 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 no. So yeah, okay, so animal aging is going to slow down. Hopefully we are able to to work our way up better in our zoo. Yeah, do we have a derby bungo face? Where's derby, derby bungo? I see a lot of adults. Oh, 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 yes, yes. Oh, 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 we have a running one. We're a running one. Hello, cutie. Make our day a better day. <laughs> With your derpy derpy face. Oh, why? I can't get enough of these cute derpy bungo faces. I just can't. They are just too adorable, aren't they? <laughs> I saw a lot of people like, oh my god, it's melting my heart. Some people had no idea. How cute the derpy bungo faces, uh, the baby bungos were looking. So here you go, here you go. For anyone that is new to the channel and you have never seen a baby bungo, eh. <laughs> there you go, especially for all of you. Let me know in the comments down below <laughs> if you are one of those. <laughs> Anyways, uh, today we're going to, uh, to work on our zoo. <laughs> Gee, what a surprise. No, we're going to work on... Um, the South America area right over here. We have a giant otter and the anteater right over here. And I actually want to build two dwarf caiman habitats. Uh, why two? Because I, I was just checking the dwarf caiman and they actually don't need that much space. So, and, and it's like uh, up to one, uh, uh, two animals in one habitat. So I was like, you know what? We're going to do something with a bridge. Uh, so water on one side, water on the other side, and then a bridge, and, and, and both water sections will be from a different habitat. And uh, we're so, so we're gonna have two habitats connected to each other, so we have a bigger area. Uh, I don't even know if, yeah, I think it's going to be somewhere over here. I think this is a little bit too small for two habitats. Uh, but that is what we're going to work on today. Uh, oh, we, but we do have to make sure that everything is running well. You are about to grow up. Now, because we slowed down aging, I think it's gonna take some time for you to really, really, really grow up. Um, so, but that, that's going to be fine. We need to uh, pay attention to our kangaroos. I almost wanted to say camels. Wasn't that a thing in the beginning? Oh my God, look at all these cuties. In the beginning that I said camels inside of kangaroos. <laughs> I wanted to do it again. Man, these, these are so cute, aren't they? Those babies are just too adorable. <laughs> Uh, I love this Australia. I was just uh, hovering over at the zoo and I was just like looking at it like oh, this Australia area really really turned out nicely like this is the only area that we basically finished I think we, I think we uh, we have a have a complete tour of it somewhere along this series but it just looks so nice I don't know with all you your blueprints from everyone I think it just looks really really amazing and I'm just really happy with that area but yeah on the other hand there are a lot of areas like this is the Australia area there are a lot of areas that are not finished yet this is kind of finished 
but then <laughs> if you go further away, there is a lot of filling the gaps that we also need to do. So uh, there goes a lot of hours in there. Oh, yes, Nathan, you made this building. You guys all love this building so much. I, I'm, I'm amazed by this building. We did this one in the previous episode, I think, with the proboscis monkey. Man, I love this building so much. Like, it's, it's just incredible. It looks really, really stunning. Oh, we have an animal talking point, but no one is here. You kidding me? What's that? That no, that can't be right. Well, apparently, <laughs> apparently that is a thing. I really thought that was a way of like attracting your guests to an area, but I guess not. Well, this is pretty far away though from everything. So I can imagine that it's just a very far walk, but oh, the building, you guys all love this building. I hope if you downloaded this building yourself, like the collection list of all the blueprints that we're using in this series is in the description down below. If you download this one, uh, do let me know in the comments down below. I can imagine that tons of you are in love with that building as well, as much as I, I am, and, and it's just amazing. But they're, they're uh, <laughs> as if, I don't know why, I'm just roaming around here being like, oh my freaking god, there are so many amazing buildings, amazing restaurants, and then everything in here. I just really, really love it. Okay, so there, are, oh, that one is now about to mature again. Uh, research of the giant otter. That is actually a good thing. Um, is there anything else we need to research? Oh, proboscis monkey, of course. Okay, do we have anyone that can stop doing research? I think this one. Uh, who are you? Francesca. Can you... Oh, how do I make you stop? Oh, maybe just here. Uh, wait, no, that was not the one. This one. Yeah, okay, I can make you stop doing that research. Are there any others that we need to do? Because that is like advanced research. It's not really necessary anymore, I think. Advanced research. Yeah, but they just make sure that we have some vets uh, free. So in case anyone gets sick or anything. Three! What's going on? Dangerous uh, fighting. Oh, our hyenas! Oh, that's right. It's been a long time since we've seen hyenas. Uh, wait, oh, species alerts, interesting. Okay, oh, 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 wait, we have one that's infertile, injured and infertile. Can I put you both, can I, can I, oh, wait, I can rehome you. Uh, can I rehome you too? Yes, I can, perfect. Um, Ar Argiasi and Afata, are they able, I, I can't remember if that is like the new boyfriend inbreeding okay no but this gyasa is uh is a silver status so what i want to do then hello gyasa what i want to do then is then the female was on the other side i think i think there was one laying down that was you are you oh no you're a juveline uh let's see Let's see, because then the other one we're going to put up for adoption. Uh, I'm not really sure if we can because you're injured right now. Uh, let's just try it. I, I can remember that I got injured animals as well um, from when I got animals from the training center. So why would that thought not work the other way around, I guess? Um, I will get back to you later on. Oh, oh boy, no, no. No! Nope, we're not gonna do that. Um, I can trade you for 40. And now we're going to get another um, spot hyena. Where are you? Here you are. Oh my god, the noise. Oh my god, the warthogs. It's been such a long time since we've seen the warthogs. Uh, 100%. So we need a female. Uh, no, we're gonna go here for only females like so oh we only have let's go for you you have a pretty high longevity uh so we're gonna send you are you what kind of color was that was that like a... i don't know it felt like a green am i go sandy fur with brown spots gray fur with brown spots she looked green like the quickly when i saw her 
I don't know what it was. Maybe I will, that was just like a glitch or anything. I don't know. It was just really odd. Okay, but we have some babies in here. But they can stay. Uh, they can stay, of course. As, oh, man. I love this area so much. <laughs> it's just so much fun to just roam around in, the, in your zoos. <gasps> oh, it's very busy in here. <gasps> so many adults. Oh, my God. Look at the different fur variations here. Oh, my God. There are so many. Why didn't we not get any message or anything? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. There are so many in here. I love these guys so much. They're so funny. Their noises. <laughs> it's just hilarious. Okay, let's have a look. Uh, because this is no bueno. <gasps> so many males! No way! Okay, we're gonna keep the youngest one. We're gonna keep the youngest one. Um, these are, are probably... This is probably inbreeding. So... Okay, let's... Put them all up for adoption. I doubt if anyone will get them, but I don't know. These are just so, such fun animals, guys. Okay, Jafari and Zainabu. I'm pretty sure that that's inbreeding. Uh, Zainabu, inbreeding. Yes, okay. So the question then is, who of you has the highest rating? So we have Jafari right over here. You have an animal appeal of 750. And uh, no, no, don't go in there. Okay. And you have an ammo of 750. Hmm? Why is that the same? This one isn't even silver. Hmm. Okay. Well, okay. So Naibu is going to go as well. And now we're going to get a girlfriend for Jafari. Uh, gray brown cause hairs. You have pretty good stats. So we're going to see if we can find a lovely lady for you. Common worth hog. There we go. Um, we have plenty of lovely ladies here. Uh, oh, let's go for her. Uh, oh, 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 be me up. And we're going to put you uh, in here. Uh, perfect. Okay, so obviously the babies cannot go right away. Uh, oh, we have a lot of quick trades, I'm afraid. Oh, we have gold stava. Never mind, six. <laughs> Wow, I bought that one for, for 33 or something, so if they do not buy this for, for 6 or 10, then uh, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, that one is going to be relocated. We already have dwarf, uh, dwarf caimans right over here. Wait, oh, oh yeah, okay, we can treat you again. Uh, so I guess no one got my clouded lepers. No one wants my sable antelopes either. Oh no! I feel so sad. No, it's all right. I'll just keep trying it, and if not, if no one will um, will will adopt them from me, then I will just put them up for uh, it, freedom in the wild. I mean, oh wait, that one is a money one. Okay, okay. Well, this should be all right. The dwarf caimans will be gone. Uh, did I hear? Yeah, that's right. I heard. I saw a message on Twitter passing by about a forum post that. They're going to expand this uh, probably to 100. I'm not, uh, don't pay me on it. I'm not 100% uh, sure, but I think that is what I read. So they're going to make it uh, a bigger um, uh, in size. So that is, that is definitely going to be an improvement. And uh, if everything goes right, I think at the end of this month or beginning of next month, there will be a free update together with a new DLC. So that is going to be... Uh, that's going to be fun, and, and I think that is when they are going to update that as well. Oh my goodness, so much noise! <laughs> are you going to do something? Are you going to have fun together? Or not? I guess not. I think it was I, I was misled. Or do you? Ooh. No! No! Nope, <laughs> so misleading. Are you going to do anything now? You're cute. No, this one is just walking in circles, I guess. All right, uh, do we have anything else? Ooh, okay. Animal welfare has attracted protesters. What are you doing here? Oh, shoo. Okay, we have money for that. Uh, animal welfare has attracted, what? How are they going? Oh, shoo, shoo, pretty shoo. Okay, wait. I, I, I'm pretty sure that I checked, but I guess not. 
There should... I don't get it. I don't get it. You have these surfers. Oh, wait. This, this doesn't look safe, but I also don't, don't see any message or anything. So that is a little bit odd, to be honest. Um, okay. Well, well, blah, blah, blah. No, that's not good. Uh, but I can imagine it's 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 here because this is uh, climbable. Can I reach you? Uh, wait a second. Can I reach you? Why can I not do anything? That is so ugly. Oh my goodness. Okay, wait. Uh, if I select just these two and then raise them and then have a oh, lot well, on both sides. Oh, who cares? No one cares. Okay, now I'm going to just duplicate one rock right over here just to ha raise this a little bit up. Just like that. Uh, but how is that even possible? I'm confused. That should not be possible. That's really, really odd that they're able to escape. Is it maybe just only the, the a baby then? Are we? Do we already have babies? Or... Oh no, that one is getting offspring. This is the female. Let me just check one more time. I don't see any any sign or anything that... Like, I can't imagine that they're able to escape, but I, I don't see where they would be able to escape. Like, I'm not missing anything, right? It's so odd. Wait, maybe it's, it's here? No, I really don't know. I honestly don't know. Wow. All right. Okay. Well, we had escaping proboscis monkeys and we had protesters, but <gasps> animal died. Oh gosh. Oh, that's so sad. Uh, Aisha. And who do we have here? Res Res Resija and Bakari. Resija and Bakari. There are like a lot of adults in here as well. They're part of a pact. Um, we have, how many, <gasps> oh my gosh, also so many, what is going on? Um, um, oh my god, there's so many, this is insane that we did not see those things. Okay, let's just go here to our zoo overview. Oh my god, there's so many, I can't believe what I'm seeing. Um, oh wait, no, it's African Wild Dog. I wanted to go to the W. Uh, okay, that one died. Yeah, I can tell. Um, I think we need to... That one, oh, I hope it's not inbreeding. So I think that's the female that we should keep. Are they all... Oh, they are all adults. Um, okay, that one is... Yeah. Rehome. There's only one to rehome. But the rest, oh, I hate it that you have to go back and now select all the animals again, but oh well. Uh, so we're, we're going to keep the, the pregnant one and the rest is going to go up for adoptions into trading center. There we go. So now the only thing that we need to do is select her. Oh, no, wait, this is the, uh, the dad. Where is the pregnant one? That's you. So what I want to check is I want to just just grab a male now so we're gonna change this and uh, we're gonna get oh, banos. <laughs> oh my god wait i totally forgot someone told me that we have an, an albino in our zoo and i totally did not see wait what uh do, wait why do i see the comma warthog oh i did not deselect them probably comma warthog okay we have female uh, we have two males which is good. I think we're gonna go for this one. Frontier Zoo, Sente Zoo. Uh, so, so there should be, but I can't remember anymore what animal it was. Someone said, oh, did you not see mm -hmm, animal, albino? And I was like, w what? No. Now I do, we have spotless uh, cheetah. That is what I know. Um, but where is an albino animal? I really can't tell. We have a black jaguar. That is what I also know. Uh, where? Oh my god, there are so many animals. I really don't see it. I really don't see any. 
Okay, we have a, we have an albino giraffe. Let me just check real quick. Oh my god, that's amazing! I love that. Uh, do do we did we miss out on anything else? No, we have an albino giraffe. <gasps> oh my gosh! Hello. We have an albino giraffe. Oh my god, this is the first time. That I have an alpine giraffe. Oh my gosh, you are so pretty. You're so pretty. We have an alpine giraffe. I can't believe what I'm seeing. We have an alpine giraffe. <gasps> oh, I love it. I love it. This is really cool. Oh man, thank you for the person pointing it out to me. Like I really did not see what what was that message? Food enrichment. You don't are you're not happy with that. Let me just check. Giraffe. If we can get some food enrichment. Do we have this one in? I don't think we do. We only have that thing. Uh so we can definitely add maybe well, we already have that. Let me just remove that one and then replace it for this one. I think that is going to make our albino giraffe very 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 happy or not speech food enrichment do we have anything else throwing pillar no i don't think so maybe we need to add two maybe just replace that one for this one as well if we just put that one here and delete that one perfect there we go oh, man thank you thank you so much for telling thank you for telling i really had no idea um all right, it's time. It is time for us to start building the dwarf caiman habitat when it is daylight again, which is going to be very soon. So yeah, let's just go and start building.
And we have dwarf caimans. So, uh, okay, as I said, we have two habitats. Uh, we have one on the right side and we have a shelter area right over here. Uh, this is the same shelter that we used uh, for the uh, giant otter habitat since this, this is the same region. And that one is made by Bobson, so you can download that one yourself as well. We have two of them, by the way. We have another one right over here. And uh, yeah, there's there's obviously there there's this chain link fence right over here separating both habitats since we can't really have that many caimans in one habitat, unfortunately. Um, look at it run. <laughs> Uh, the habitats are both big enough. I first thought this is way too big, actually, but I think it's it's all right. Now that I think of it, wait a second. If I just... Oh, yeah, okay. It needs 200 and it's like double the size, but I don't think that really matters. I would rather see it to have it, uh, being too big than being it uh, too small. So, uh, yeah, both habitats look a little bit similar. Uh, they have this little this water section with, like, these rocks in the middle. And uh, we make it a little bit more greener and lush with, like, uh, some bigger trees and some uh, sunken trees and some, some apple trees and stuff. Inside, are you going to play with your ball? Probably not. Hi. I wanted to say cutie, but you're... Uh, yeah, well, you're cute small. <laughs> But you're, you are, are cute. I, I, I chose to not have an underwater viewing. Like you can do that, but I don't know. I find them a little bit too small. Uh, not that interesting enough to make an underwater viewing for it. So I chose to just go for like not so steep water to make sure that the guests can just see the uh, caiman just swim around right over here in the water pretty up close and they can also see it when it's going to eat maybe these bins are not really the best spot <laughs> like it's pretty much in the way if guests would wanna uh wanna see them up close over here and they can also do it right over here it's also not really the best spot right over here well who cares it's about the education oh i did not think of you being able to climb up there uh we need to make sure that our animal talking point is working. I think everything is all right right over here. Where's the other? Okay, let's just check here. No, I don't think so. Okay, we have an animal talking point right over here, but we also need a work roster. So I was actually just thinking to what was that roster called again? Um, with the otter and stuff. I should have no idea. Giant Anteater. I think that is the one. So we're going to edit that one. And we're going to put everything from here inside. And now we're going to go back and we're going to have the everything work roster as well. Just to be sure. There we go. Everything work roster. Edit. If we can. There is a lot in here. Just to be sure. Okay, and now we we have an educator in that region. So we have a Clara Leopard Giant Otter. This one is what I was looking for. So we have uh, the Giant Otter giant, and Eater. So we have May, July. And then I would say this one would be two months after July. So September. And this one is in the same work roster as that one. So that educator should be able to just do all these uh, educational uh, points in one go. Or I don't know. Is that smart? Maybe we should give it a little bit of uh, freedom in between. So instead of doing that, because I don't know, it's like a month for it to walk from one side to the other. Side. That sounds ridiculous, though, in real life. But uh, just trying to think how the game works. So I think just December was a good one if, if it would want to go and have uh, uh, go to the staff room to relax for a little bit. Um, yeah, but, uh, but I'm happy. This is this definitely feels like a cooler area already with like the shaders and like the uh, with the water itself, of course. So I think this is going to be a nice area where the people can uh, relax and just uh, see the dwarf caiman swimming around. I like this area. Do let me know if you like it as well. I think I'm uh, I'm very happy with this. Uh, are these dwarf caimans going to swim all the time? I just want to see you up close. You're just chilling here. It's warm, so why not, right? I think everything from the welfare is alright. Oh, wow, that's perfect.
perfect lady. You actually did that really, really nicely. Let me just look at you really up close. Oh, I can't get closer. You're really pretty. You're really pretty. I'm not gonna say cute, but you are really p pretty. <laughs> They're really awesome, aren't they? I actually, that, those are the things, like some animals. This is the, only the second time that I at these guys in a zoo. But the first time was with the boat safari. I actually didn't even look at them, like only for the cinematic shots. But they, these kind of series with franchise mode really makes you look at these type of animals way more up close and just see the beauty of them, which you would sometimes even forget, I guess. How is the rest of our zoo doing? We have a proboscis monkey. Okay. Uh, what? Unbox. Are you able to, to walk from there? Yes, you are. Okay, well, hopefully that's going to be all right. An animal died. A giraffe. <gasps> what? Uh, what? <laughs> How are you? Oh my god, the flies. I'm not entirely sure if this is how you should die. There are the paws are. <laughs> the what is this angle? <laughs> oh my freaky god, this is just. I'm uh, sorry. I should not laugh, but how you died? Oh my god, you poor thing. Just look at this face and that tongue. Oh my god. <laughs> I should not laugh, but this is just really. Um... Yeah, this is not how you should die. Let's just put it that way. Nuru, rest in peace. I'm really, really sorry. Oh, the flies. Aww, you poor thing. I hope it wasn't your mom. Who was your mom, actually? I have no idea. Uh, can I see that? That should be here. Stop book parents. Oh, it's not. They are still alive, but uh, I is already pretty old. Or Aoife, I have no idea how to say that. Cutie! Oh my gosh, you're so adorable. You are just so adorable. Oh, I can't see the face up close. Unfortunately, unfortunately, that's such a pity. Okay, we're going to wrap it up. Let me just go back to my favorite face of today. You cutie pie. Thank you guys so much for watching. Do let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think of the dwarf caiman habitat that we just built. And if you have any suggestions for the next animal, do let me know in the comments as well, of course. Leave a like at the video if you guys enjoyed. And subscribe, of course. Oh, you're going to swim. And subscribe, of course, if you haven't already. And if you want to see more Planet Zoo content, I definitely have you covered on the channel. And don't forget to check out Instant Gaming, where you can find uh, Planet Zoo or any other game with a huge discount. So definitely go and check out the link in the description. Or find me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, which are also in the description down below. <laughs> so many links. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I really do hope to see you guys... Oh, don't drown. <laughs> to see you guys all in the next one. Bye, guys.